today I am going to be letting Instagram decide on my day. Um, yesterday night I put up a little uh, Instagram story that said that today I am going to be sort of like doing posts throughout the day to let my followers decide how my day should proceed. So basically just giving them between two choices because Instagram posts you can only have two choices. I am not very optimistic about it because I feel that given um, two choices like uh, followers will typically choose the worst choice for you. So I'm going to go out of the house and you guys get to decide what I am going to wear out of the house. So behold the options. <laughs> so I'm going to ask them now, what should I wear today? Okay, so for every poll, I will wait for 10 minutes and then I'll go with the majority's decision. So right now, it's only been a few minutes, uh, but the Zipa is raining by quite a lot. So usually for things like this, the results doesn't really fluctuate a lot. I've always seen that it kind of stays the same after the first few minutes. So I'm just gonna go with Chi now then. So majority of you guys voted for the Chi Pao, so I'm wearing my Chi Pao now. I guess it's actually the prettier of the two options. And I got appropriate hair, and plus I'm the right race to wear this, so it's not cultural appropriation. <laughs> actually, it looks quite nice la. It like, fits me quite well, but it's just it's very very hot and made of this like cheapo synthetic material. So yeah, today it's quite warm leh. So I think we're going out and then I'll just probably die in this. And I think a lot of people will stare at me and think that I'm crazy lah. But then again, I'm quite used to that, so it's okay. Okay, it's time for the next poll. After I'm dressed, I am going to go out. So guys, should I go to the east now or should I go to the west? It's up to you guys. So much power in your hands. I always feel the option at the right side gets more answers because people accidentally press that to go to the next snap. So I shall put east there because I don't want to go to the west. <laughs> Smart, right? The West is like <laughs> very far away from my house, and I'm sure people will make me go there with bus, and I don't want to spend two hours in the bus. Okay. Okay. So it's been ten minutes. I'm gonna check the results now. It says fifty-four percent for the West and forty-six percent for the East. So I guess the West won. So um, the producers have written the exact location that I'm supposed to go to. So I guess I'll open the West one. Which is like. Terrible. This is Changi Airport. Changi Airport is so nice! Why? We could have gone to Changi Airport and sat on the like the three story slide. You still have to go to Tuas. Next, I am going to let my followers decide how I'm gonna get to Tuas. So I think it's either by bus slash train or by private car. Okay, so it's been about six minutes and Obviously, bus and train is winning by a lot, so I think this one is confirmed there's a winner. So let's just go with it. Okay, I'll take the train. I haven't taken it in many years. And I'm going to go journey to the west now. So I guess I will. Ignore it. I can spin it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> so to go to the MRT, I have decided that the best way for me to do so is to just go to the bus stop and ask a random stranger how to get to the nearest MRT station. And I will patiently sit here and wait and act like I'm very, very normal. You see, the lady is in a sari, she's an ethnic dress, so can I? Normal? Oh my god, how much is it? Nobody knows. Never mind, I'll put one dollar. It cannot be more than that. Uncle Chi is a Rangoon uh, MRT dollars out One dollar. <gasps> there I was in my era, right? We take bus, it's only 25 cents or something. And then now it's like one dollar and forty cents. What the hell? No wonder people say Singapore very expensive. I think the last time I took a bus was five years ago, maybe. Since I drove, I don't think I took a bus. Even then before that I would rarely take buses. I usually just call a cab. Like it's not that I'm rich, you know, it's just that it's just like I'm always late, so I don't have a choice of taking a bus usually. Okay, so I think the MRT is this way, so let's go. <laughs> Everyone's like, what's wrong with this woman? Can I eat in the MRT or cannot? Oh my god, that's so sad. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and just do that. Won't get fined lah, who's gonna find me? Hey, what kind of like terrible, like this is terrible man. There's no freedom of anything. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Okay, I'm looking at the map now to decide where to go. Okay, so I guess right now, where am I now? Oh, am I? No, wait, I'm here. Okay, so I have to take the train to go to Tuas. I guess I'll go to Tuas Crescent because it's considered Tuas and it's the, the nearest one. Go like, titi 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 like this to Bona Vista and change the green line. Correct? Okay, alright. It works Tuas here. This side. Oh, this smells like the old MRT. 
Oh my god, it's so beautiful here. Okay, so our MRT train stopped at Jukun and then I realized that it's not going to Tuas. So it's really weird because when I was trying to get my ticket, the machine actually let me select Tuas Crescent, which I selected and paid for. So now apparently the train doesn't go there. It's MRT, hello, we got your idea. Okay, so I clarified with the staff. So apparently, it's not that there's no train to go to Tuas, but the Jukun train does not go to Tuas. Yeah. You take a shuttle bus downstairs to go to Gao, and then from Gao station, take the train to go to Tuas. Okay, so now we're waiting for the little shuttle bus to bring us from Jukun station to Gao station. I don't know why somehow the train does, does not go to Tuas and they don't tell you beforehand they just like assume that you're just gonna be okay with this anyway so it shows you that if you're going to Tuas nobody cares about you or your feelings so that's me I guess right now so we left my house at about 1 p.m. and now the time is about 2.40 and we still haven't even reached Tuas yet It's so warm here, I'm dying in my chi pao. Almost wish you guys chose the fubu. Okay, so now we're at Gao Circle. We are on our way to go to Tuas Crescent now. We will finally reach our destination in two hours after we set off. The train is like super empty because look at that, it's freaking empty. So I guess we are right at the end of Singapore now. Any more west and we'll kind of drop into the sea. The time now is five minutes to three. We're finally reached. Yes, we are at Tuas Crescent, guys. Look at that! Feels like, like some kind of adventure, but actually it's just within Singapore. <laughs> I'm sure that, oh my god, what's with these stairs? It's so long. Hey, this picture very nice. I'll take a photo here. Tuas got very Instagrammable stairs. In case people who want to do like blog shop shoots or whatnot can come here. Oh my god, stations are so empty. There's nobody here at all. You can do whatever fuck you want here. Is there any nice food to eat around here? Nice food, ah. Uh. The, we only have one at MLT Centre. How long? 10 minutes walk. Wow, so far away. Actually, this goes through here. Yeah. There's nowhere nearby where we can walk to to eat? Ah? No, no, no. Oh my god. Yeah. So basically, there's nowhere to eat around here. The nearest food place is 10 minutes away. And according to that guy, 10 minutes walk. Lah. Meaning that for girls, it's probably at 20 minutes walk. See lah, you guys. If you have picked the east, then we'll be in Changi Airport. And it'll be so nice and beautiful. And pride of Singapore, etc. And instead, where is Tuas? Happy now? That's what is smelling like shit. Wow, disgusting. You guys. Hey there, we're at the amenity centre. Turns out it's a real place. There seems to be a lot of options here for us to choose from. So let's just go in and have a look. This is called the Second Link Food Centre. So let's just eat here. Oh my god, I'm gonna let you guys decide what I'm supposed to eat for lunch. Okay, so today I'm gonna try to go out of my comfort zone and order some food that I wouldn't usually choose. So I picked two of the stores that is my least um, favourite choices and you guys can decide which one I should order. Here is option number one, like fish soup store from here or Indian food from there. Alright, so um, it has just been a few minutes since I last posted my poll. Overwhelmingly, people chose Indian food. So, let's get Indian food. Okay, so now I'm asking people whether I should eat mee goreng or murtabak. Okay, so murtabak won the poll. Now I'm going to go and order my food. Let's go. So I know you guys want me to do something embarrassing. So now that I'm waiting for my food, should I dance around the food court singing the Shanghai Tan song? Or should I approach one of uh, the groups of guys here and ask them whether my chi pao is nice or not and whether they think I'm pretty or not? So the murtabak has arrived. It's time for me to eat. I have never ordered murtabak in my life. Can you believe it? So today is the first time. I don't know why I never ordered murtabak before. I, in general, don't really like Indian food because I hate parsley. And so I don't like any kind of food right that they might chop up parsley and put inside the stuff. So for me, like motorbike is very mysterious. I don't know what's inside there. I feel like it's very likely that there's parsley inside. I just won't order it. Uh, okay, so it's full of onions and I don't I don't like onions. So I mean I don't hate them but I don't want a mouthful of onions la. So I'm just gonna eat the corner la. It's okay, I will still eat it because I promise. Very onion yeah. The poll results are in, I finished eating and 61% of people asked me to dance. It's okay, I'll follow through, I'll go and dance now, alright? I'll do that. I'm fucking embarrassed. Okay, don't be shy, alright, we'll never see this man again. It's okay. Now I'm going to sing a song. 
朗流，万里滔滔江水永不休，途尽了世间事。慢作土，都一片潮流。是喜，是愁。I forgot the lyrics。就算分不清欢笑悲忧，仍然分百千浪。万里滔滔，哒哒哒哒。Nobody care about me. You see how calm they are. They're just like, can we like go now? Okay, so I'm sufficiently embarrassed. I'm still blushing now. You can't see because I'm wearing a lot of makeup. But let's get out of here. So now I'm just gonna explore this place a little bit, see what they have. Guess what? I have arrived at a 4D shop right now. So should I buy 4D? Because I don't ever buy 4D. So I don't think I'll win. But all right. Should I bet? Yes or no? So most people voted that I should. Okay, so most people voted that I should go ahead and buy it, so I guess I will. So right now, I'm going to poll whether I should buy uh, today's date or the time right now. Alright, so overwhelmingly, people voted for uh, the time right now versus today's date. So I went ahead and bought the time. I bought $4, too big, too small, I don't know what that means, but... Okay, $4, I don't mind losing, I guess. By the time this episode comes out, uh, the results will be out. And most likely, I will not have won anything, because I've never won anything in my life. No lucky draws whatsoever. So, but if this time it wins, uh, next time I buy 40, I sure go and poll people again. Come to the end of the episode. As usual, don't forget to like, subscribe, and also hit that little bell icon so you get a notification every time a new video comes out. Or you can also download the Click Network app so you can watch all of our videos before they come out on YouTube. Thank you very much for watching. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. So earlier I asked people whether they regretted sending me to Tuas instead of to Changi Airport, and 66% say they do not regret it. I think that they're enjoying themselves. I guess after all, this is quite an adventure and like Changi Airport, everyone has been to right? But to us, not everyone has been here. So here you go, here I am.